Hello, it's Jason Payne for JDP Realty Group, a cool banker, Dean Harper Realtor. Well, I've got another beautiful home tour set up for you. This home is located in Rockwell Ranch. It is a one acre community and the location is perfect if you want to have easy access to New Braunfels, which is about an eight minute drive from here. The city of Shirt Cibolo is also about eight minutes away. And if you want to go to Highway 281 via Highway 1683, well, that's only about 10 minutes away. So you have easy access with ever, to everything without ever getting on a major highway. Anyways, this is a beautiful home. It was built in 2007. It is a five bedroom, four and a half bath, 5,130 square feet. Yeah, 5,130 square feet with a gorgeous pool. I mean, a drop dead gorgeous pool and a beautiful movie theater so uh yeah let's stop chatting and uh go check it out this is a mediterranean styled home and it is beautiful now one of the bedrooms is a casita which what if you're coming from out of state and don't know exactly what a casita is it's like a little private apartment and they're gonna have their own private entrance right through that way gonna have a full bedroom kitchen and door I will show you that when we get in here this is in the city of Garden Ridge uh, sorry no this city of New Braunfels Garden Ridge is around the corner Comel ISD so you're gonna have great schools there is a new high school that they just opened up called Davenport High School and uh, let's get around these trees here but uh yeah this is a beautiful quiet community it's been here for a little bit so you're not going to have a lot of construction everywhere lots of oak trees and cedar trees and most of these houses are going to be on one acre plots this one is actually on 1.7 all right let's go ahead inside and check it out just a beautiful entrance to this house love the uh, double wide doors nice brick i mean a uh, rock coming up and just a beautifully landscape does have the spanish tiles which is a nice touch but let's check out the inside just beautiful Some fancy lights nice entryway and definitely right when you walk in you can tell it's got that mediterranean feel beautiful staircase going up and i love this tile all right, right when you come in you do have your main living space let me give a slow panoramic look at it you've got the fireplace in the corner plenty of space to be hanging around and these curtains that you see up above those are electronic curtains so all you gotta do is push a button and you can black out this whole area but you can see you've got a beautiful kitchen and there's that gorgeous staircase going up with some beautiful windows on it all right, so let's go check out the kitchen because I know you're excited about that. Love the rock finish on the countertop. Not a 50-50 sink, but it is stainless steel. Perfect spot for your breakfast nook right there. And just the ceiling work in this house is really nice. love the fact that they do have a pot filler now the cooktop is a little bit dated but from KitchenAid remember this house was built in 2007 but it does have gas and if you wanted to put a more modern cooktop on there that's so easy to do Doven, double ovens for if you're cooking for that uh, big Thanksgiving entertaining and speaking of entertaining this house is so perfect for that and wait till you see it and I'll show you more about it built-in microwave got a nice little office nook here and gotta check out the pantry got a really good sized pantry but wait there's more we've got two good sized pantries so definitely not gonna run out of uh, space to store your goodies loving this island just so much details in this place i'm going to have to find out because this it does look like it's built in but it's something if you're interested in this house i'll have to find out if this refrigerator conveys because that is 
an oversized commercial grade refrigerator there. But check this out. This definitely would stay, but you've got your own little espresso machine built right in. These things are not cheap, so it's nice to have that in it. All right, back there is the owner suite. I want to save that for last so you guys don't stop the video. It's like, hey, we've seen the owner suite. We're going to stop it now. One thing my wife mentioned is like I need to hit you guys up as you're watching it is make sure you hit like and subscribe to this, this channel. It is growing faster than I ever dreamed of, but uh, you hitting that like button definitely helps. We're going now into the casita. This room here, we've got two different doors. So pretty sure there's a door on this side too. Okay, nope, not a door on that side, but you can shut this door and lock it. You do have a um, powder room, or is this a full bath? Okay, no, just a powder room on this side, open to the main house. But let's look at this casita here. So perfect if you have that multi-generational family, say if you want your parents, you don't want to put them in a special living place, you want to keep them close by, but not so close by, you can have them have their own little apartment with a full kitchen. Let's take a look at that. We'll have their own microwave, own oven, a nice sink, and even a living space. This door here is the private entrance to the casita, so definitely keep that level of independence to be able to have access to come and go as you please and even your own personal garage. It's a one car garage. They are using it for storage, but you would have access to that. Now, I will caution you, if you have that 23 year old, do not buy this house because you will never get them out of this little apartment. They will stay here forever because it's beautiful. I'm waiting until you see the pool, you'll see why but plenty of living space for someone. I've done some video tours of some people who have the, the casitas, but this is done up right. It's got the same theme, the same finishes as what's in the main living space. You do have your, this is the bathroom of the casita. It's got a full shower, toiletries, and uh, oh, I don't have well, no sense turning it on. It's just a, a nice walk-in closet. Let's check out the bedroom. Like I said, this is a full self-contained apartment. And it still has high ceilings. So just a perfect place if you want to do that multi-generational family in a luxury community. All right, let's go back to the main wing of the house because I definitely want to show off this pool. All right. We do have some bedrooms upstairs. I will get to those after we see this pool. And this pool is definitely how it's located, becomes a focal point for this house. So if you're looking for an entertainment home, which why I'm shooting this video is my client that's uh, out of state. He is looking for a home to entertain, and this is it. Well, one of the contenders. There's a couple homes that I videoed that he's definitely interested in, but this definitely checks off those boxes as well. Perfect sitting area. I love how you've got the different wings and they all have covered, coverage. But let's check out this pool. Beautiful pool. It is, uh, I might get his name right, Mike Czar. He's one of the really high end custom pool guys in the area. And you can see this kind of gradually walks down to about six inches and then drops off. Perfect for if you want to sit and hang, dangle your legs over and uh, without getting all the way into the pool. Just beautiful. Keith Zars. Sorry, this is a Keith Zars pool. 
Definitely got the nice hot tub and it's just gorgeous out here. Give it a little another view of uh, this whole space. I mean, you've got your own little private resort. Um, you do have a little bit of grass on the other side of this wall. Actually a pretty good chunk of beautiful lawn with a rock wall separating from the other property. All right, speaking of what else is out here, I showed you the casita. This could be um, another guest room. Perfect for those long-term guests. So if you don't want them to have them right into the house, you can have your extended stay guest with a full bedroom and a full bath. So you do have a bath shower combination and just perfect for if you got some uh, people visiting you from out of state, they have their perfect little uh, hostel slash Airbnb type place. They don't want you renting it out. They kind of don't like that too much in some of these communities. But if you got your out of state guest quarters, you've, there you go. And other entrances. I believe this goes into the garage and they've got it locked. But it gives you, yeah, that's the garage right there. But it gives you a little bit of view from coming in. I don't want to walk all the way around just to show you the garage entrance. But I do want to take you upstairs and show you the additional bedrooms. And we're going to finish off in the owner suite that also has access to this pool. Before I do that, notice they've got a little kitchen, outdoor kitchen set up. So if you're doing, uh, doing a little grilling, do a little margarita drinking, this is a perfect place to set that up. So, like I said, mentioned earlier, this is a great house for entertaining. Put a little couple of bar stools there and you are good to go, my friend. All right, let's head back inside and head upstairs. We do have like little coat closet set up. I absolutely love this staircase. not so narrow that you have to feel unsafe walking down it. Well, view from above. Q. All right, they have used this bedroom as the office. Once again, they do have the tray ceiling, lots of can lights, perfect office setup. Or if you needed to use this as a bedroom, we have a good size closet just for that. Don't want to show off all their personal stuff. But this room does have access to the balcony. Shower. roof a little bit more but this this is a money shot right here check this out just sitting up and drinking some coffee overlooking this that's not so bad yeah this is a nice place I have to look at my sheet to confirm but I believe they are asking right about 1.3 for this house sorry if I didn't mention that earlier And the office slash other bedroom, this set up as a Jack and Jill, where you do have access to the bathroom from both doors. Its own toilet, sh tub shower combination. I've got this blocked off right now, but it goes out to the main living space as well. So 
people upstairs can use it. I definitely love these sit on top sinks. I've done one of those in my primary residence. But it's the other bedroom on the upstairs side with its own access to that patio. And once again, another giant size closet. That's really big. Let's see, and mentioned that he had the movie theater. Check this bad boy out. This is a properly done uh, theater room. Definitely wide enough, set back enough. That looks like a 100 inch screen. They could easily go 120 inch screen without having it, uh, you sit up so close. You're, I, I built my own projector screen, but your thing is you don't want to be sitting so close that you're literally having to turn your head to see the whole screen. So they could actually go a little bit bigger, but this is a beautiful setup. They've got it pre-wired for your center channel, your main speakers, and your rear speakers. And they've got a good selection of uh, projectors. Epson makes a really good 4K projector, and uh, they went a little crazy on that sub. But that's perfect movie room for entertaining and really done up right. All right, let's head back downstairs and check out that owner suite. All right, back downstairs now. The asking price for this house as of beginning of September 2021 is 1.35. Showing off the breakfast nook area a little bit. Let me come around and show an angle you haven't seen yet of the kitchen. Like I said, perfect for entertaining. Put all these stools up there with plenty of space to spare. Oh, we haven't seen the laundry room yet. But here is the formal dining room with a really cool ceiling. This, closet, this door also goes into the garage, but here is the laundry room. does have its own sink cabinets, and a folding area. Let's see if we can get into this. And we can. All right. This is just the two car garage space. Make sure I don't show the license plate. They do have a water softener system. So there you go. head into the owner suite. Just right through these uh, two double doors and boom, you're in the owner suite. It's a really nice size. You got plenty of room for king size bed and still remaining stuff on the side. Dual windows and two dual French doors that you can open up with great access to that pool. And then boom, we are into the spa-like bathroom. Definitely keeping that Mediterranean feel. Got the jetted tub, little chandelier above it. Nice little makeup section. And then the combination double vanity section. Just a water closet right there. And then the big walk-in closet. Plenty of space in here. One last look around. Like I said, lots of storage space in these uh, cabinets.
I just realized before I do the, my wrap up, I do want to show off the shower here. It does have a beautiful mud inset shower with the rain head up above and another full size shower on the cord there. Very beautiful, very nicely done. All right, that's gonna wrap up this beautiful home that was built in 2007 in the Rockwell Ranch community in New Braunfels. That gives you great access to both shirts, New Braunfels, anything off 281, all without getting on the highway. Now, if you like this video, as I mentioned before, hit that like button and subscribe and uh, keep sharing with your friends because uh, it does help grow my business. I am a real estate agent that can represent a buyer of this house. This house is already listed by somebody else, but it might be a good fit for my client. If it's not, hey, it might be a good fit for you too. So uh, appreciate you sharing your friends. And also remember, as a buyer, you do not pay any realtor commission. So please do not go through this process alone. All right, talk to you soon. Take care now.